Yo, 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 boys, what is going on? And welcome back to the channel. We are back, and it has been a while, but I'm back at it. You know, I've had some other things going on. I've just finished off my university exams for the summer, so, you know, I only have one more year left to go with that. You know, um, so you got to dial in sometimes, boys. But let me know how you all have been. You know, it's been a minute, and it's good to be back. It feels feels like a long time coming. Definitely feel like I'm going to be a bit rusty at this. But, you know, we're back at it today, and we're playing a bit of Clash. Now, I've not been pushing as much on this game, you know, because... Obviously, I've been a bit busy, as I said. But, you know, let me know what you guys have been do going. You, I'm sure you guys have still been pushing up there. Let me know what's going on in your guys' life. You know, maybe a lot of you guys have exams as well. Maybe you guys are better than me and you can balance your... your playing stuff and doing your studying and stuff i'm just not that advanced i'm sorry guys um, but anyways yeah we're back to the boys we're playing a bit of a uh, hog eq you know just trying to get back into the swing of things because you know this is my favorite deck and i i haven't played it in a long time it, it feels weird obviously you can see in league six you know i've been doing a little bit of playing this early season but nothing too dramatic drastic dr dramatic yeah it's Speaking English here too, very well. And <laughs> nothing too drastic, you know, just a little bit of fun here and there. But anyways, enough waffling aside about me. How have you guys been? You know, it's been a while. I feel, I feel, I don't know. I feel, I feel rusty about this place. You know, it's, it's, it's been, it's been, it's been different. <laughs> but one thing I am happy about now is the fact that Dagger Duchess is nowhere near what. Oh, that's just. My rust is coming through. What, well, she's going to go for the goblin? Oh, never mind. <laughs> Anyways, boys, is one thing I am happy about is the fact that Dagger Duchess is no longer the absolute demon that it was whenever I last played this. Um, you know, last season it was just awful to play against, and the fact that it had so much HP was just atrocious. But we're past that now, you know. We're in a more peaceful time of Clash. We don't need to worry so much about what tower they have as much as just outplaying them. Um, even though you still do. I mean, it is still probably the best uh, tower troop. If you were to ask me, I mean, slightly, slightly biased opinion. I, mean, I don't have it, so I can't really give that good of a of a thing on it. But, you know, I, I do just think that it is by far the best. And I don't think that will really change. So, he's not going to go for his uh, Tesla here. Maybe he just didn't have it in hand. I just waved some earthquake. But we're off to a pretty good start. We have a lot more damage done than he has. Let's go for a firecrack here. And we're just going to go for the log. Might have been a bad log. He will just go for his goblin gang. Or his goblin barrel now. Uh, we just go for the goblins. Take that out, hopefully. We'll go for ice spirit here. And then we just need to go for another log. And that'll be all that cleaned up. Don't need to worry too much. Going to be even on damage, give or take. Um... Which isn't ideal considering that I have a level 14 and he has level 13. But he's going to give us a little bit of damage up that right side. Which is really, really nice. If I go Earthquake here. And then, yeah, we just need to get around to another Log and Earthquake and we win this game, don't we? I think. I think that's how it works. Uh, we're going to see if our Log this time will be a bit more mature about it. We'll go for the Log way in the back the way. Because we knew, we knew that tricky barrel was coming. And then if we just go for this. Don't get caught out. And then we'll go for the Earthquake. We'll go for the Firecracker and that will be game over for game number one, boys. And yes, guys, we are back for game number two against Mr. Mole here. And he's hitting us with a good luck. You know, maybe he's going to be... He's either going to be really toxic or he'll be a nice guy. You can never tell. Sometimes the most toxic players ever just hit good luck just to be annoying. We're just going to take that one hit from the Dark Golden because my reactions are too slow. But that's okay. You know, hopefully it won't matter too much. Let's go for Hog Rider here up the left. Um, he will counter pretty easy because he has Dagger Dodges. But we're going to pull out his uh, Skeleton Army anyway, which is quite nice for us. You know, I'll take that. And then we can hopefully get a King to Activation going here unless he goes or something like that which is a little bit annoying but we go for the tesla we go for our goblins we should clean all that up with ease you know it shouldn't cause us too much damage it'll cause it actually a lot more than i thought it would and <laughs> okay that's not ideal but you know bad starts do not equate to bad games you know we, we can still pull this back we can still get this win pretty easily and um yeah, so let me know, as I said in the last game, what are you guys up to these days, you know, do you have exams, are you, are you, maybe you're not in school at all, um, but nonetheless, you know, exam season is stressful, so if you are sitting exams, I, I hope they all go well for you guys, and um, I know that can be a very stressful time for everyone, and it, it's not fun putting in like 10 hour days of study, uh, you, you're not alone in it, boys, and um, let's go for the earthquake here in case he says to go scar me, which he's not going to, he's just going to go for the mega knight, typical, typical, what, what more could we expect, you know, um, back back to the, th the things we love and um, we're let the firecracker hit on the left side we we'll just go for the ice spirit here oh nice take out them bots and then we go for the evil knight and um, we'll go for the firecracker here just to make sure we we don't take a hit on the tower from the mega knight and um, because that would be the game over pretty much whereas if we can hold on to this tower for a little while you know we'll keep ourselves up well it won't be too bad for the time being now i might just go for a hog rider log here and um, yeah we'll go for the hog log why not see what he decides to do about it he should go Skarmy, I imagine. Yeah, he will. And we're going to get uh, maybe two hits off. 
Second hit? No, just the one hit. One hit is A-OK -okay with me. Um, okay, we'll just try and catch this here in the center with that. And then we'll go for a knight on top of our firecracker and hopefully just take that down. No, of course we can't take it down. Why would we? Um, we want to save our... Uh, oh, I thought he would have had his Evo Roger. I mean, he just doesn't have Evo Roger. And if he doesn't, I mean, that's very nice because normally you always have Evo come up against you. Um, but anyways, guys, I am sorry if I am a little bit uh, rusty today, you know. Please forgive me. It has been a while, as I said, more than once. And I will stop saying because I'm definitely getting really annoying. But, um, yeah, you know, it, it, it's, it's kind of rough just sitting and talking to a mic sometimes, especially if you're not used to it. it. takes you back to whenever I first started this a good few months ago now. And have I just met... Oh, no, that might actually cost you game no joke um come on please 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 don't get that ability back nice oh wait we can just go for the earthquake here and um, he's gonna should take my tower here i think no he, he won't he won't is he not going to well that's very convenient for me and we turn this game around nice and easy boys let's go nice win for game number two and yes guys we're back for the third and final game against mr gizzler here and actually i wanted to say this emote the one in the bottom left i don't want to play this because i don't want this guy i don't want to be toxic you know there's no need this guy's done nothing to me but um <laughs> it's, it's actually my new favorite mode in the game. Not even because it's toxic. I just love the sound that the prince makes when it cries. It's so stupid. It's so funny. I don't know why. It just it just makes my day hearing that noise. Like I don't even get mad when people play it. Which is like, what is this? Boys, right, we're in, we're in for a rough one here. We'll go for the knight off to the right, and we'll go for the goblins on top of the P.E.K.K.A. And that should count that all. But that's just outrageous, the fact that what, what, what a fun game this should be. Um, so we're just going to go for the for the hog rider here behind the knight. I was going to just put it in whatever side the firecracker went to. Sometimes the firecracker just does her own thing. She likes to go to the left side whenever, you know, you want her to go to the right. So we were going to let her just make up her mind, you know, because uh, we respect the decisions that the firecracker decides to make, you know. Firecracker makes some random ones. So whenever it makes a decision, you got to respect that and this guy i don't really know why you would play i know dagger dodge is kind of better but like i feel like especially now with the hp nerf you need to take the level dispar dis disparities into account more beforehand he would still have like similar hp but i don't really know why you would play a level 12 um, but i mean I'll, I'll take it it makes my life a little bit easier even though he is playing the dagger duchess and if we go for the lock here we should take out his firecracker as well which is extra nice boys this game's off to a very good start for us we cannot complain one bit i got my knight here in the back maybe a bit of a bad play because we leave ourselves a bit set to that pekka rushing out or not pekka mega knight and I would highly imagine he's going to go for this Pekka Mega Knight rush up the left side. And I misplaced my Tesla because I am just so good, boys. Honestly, don't lose your touch around here. Um, okay, let's go for the for the Ice Spirit here. I'll go for my Firecracker. We're just going to get around to this Evo Knight. And I think we can clean this all up quite nicely. Pull back. Oh, oh, never mind, never mind. We need to take that down right now. You know what, I'll leave it. We take a little bit of damage, but that's okay. We know we're just going to ignore that and pretend I didn't play that absolutely horribly. Um, okay, let's go for the goblins here. Then we'll follow this up with our hog rider. And we're going to go for the log ourselves. Now our, our firecracker is going to take a knight. Um, a little bit unfortunate, but he's going to go for a pack or a mega knight or something here. I can just, I can smell it. Um, no, he won't. Okay. There he goes, the pack. Does he even, does he even have time? I mean, what, what, what point do you realize? Yeah, like this push isn't working and you just give up. But, you know, I respect, I respect the... The, the continuation to keep trying, you know, man does not give up for no one. He's got he's got one one tack in his pocket and he he will make it work no matter what. <laughs> okay, so let's go for our goblins here. And then we're gonna go for another firecracker. He doesn't have the elixir to save it up or defend it. We're gonna go for this. We just need to defend honestly. We don't even need to we don't even need to counterattack this. We don't even need to fully we just need to waste time here. We should be able to defend this without issue, but Oh, I did not mean that. Okay, my fat fingers got in the way. And hopefully that doesn't cost us a game. That Pekka would have got a hit. It would have been a different game. But anyways, boys, that is it. And yes, guys, this is the deck that we did run for today's video. Now, you all know this deck. I don't need to show you guys. I don't need to gas it up to you. Um, as I said, I'll say one last time. Sorry if today's video is a little over the place. You know, it has been well over a month since I did this. So, you know, we will get back in the groove of things. And if you are new, don't just judge my, my life choices off this video. Um, do be sure to hit that subscribe button and check it out tomorrow or check it out in a few days. You know, maybe they'll start to get better again. But anyways, guys, thank you for coming and thank you for watching. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out.